Brad Nichols here, Flex Online with Bill Wilmore. Bill, back to the Olympia, ready to do battle. How was everything coming into uh, to this, you know, the whole year, really? Well, it's been a great year for me. Um, I actually think that I figured out a couple different things about my body. And um, if you look at, you know, if you, if you see how I looked at the Masters in Toronto, and hopefully tomorrow, you know, you'll, you'll notice that I been been making improvements that I haven't been making earlier in the years um, and it's just a matter of tweaking and figuring out some things that allowed allowed me to stay in good condition and hold on to my muscle one of the uh, things that I noticed this year is we have a bundle of guys over 40 and it seems like these guys are not only over 40 but all of them are maybe at their all-time best or, or some of them are for sure at their all-time best they've added a lot of size you appear to be much bigger uh, than you was even at the Toronto Pro yeah, it, it's, it's crazy. I, I mean, I tell people all the time, one thing really that's important is as you get older in bodybuilding, you just have to be smarter. A lot of times, like, you know, five years ago, I might, I might have been squatting and I felt a little tweak or something and I would have just kept going. But now you're like, okay, let, let's, let's make it through this battle so we can actually have the next leg work out and keep improving. And um, I just got a lot smarter and also... You just know that you everything matters. Like like not missing meals. I remember when I was younger, you know, I would compete. Be like I'd be running around, and it's like wouldn't have my food with me at all times. Now it's like from that time go, you know, it's like I just know for me to com compete at this level, I can't afford to miss a beat. So and that's another thing that's allowed me to improve. I think it's one of those things where maybe when you're younger you get away with a lot more, but you have to make sure everything is efficient. I think and and you kind of learn from that. It, is putting on size easier now, maybe harder, and is conditioning, you know, is it kind of a flip-flop? Um, conditioning actually has never really been a problem for me. It's been a matter, it's been more of a matter of getting that, uh, that combination together of coming in shape and not sacrificing my muscle to be in shape. And I feel like, you know, we, we've kind of really got that down now. So now it looks like I'm improving more because I'm, I'm allowed to, because I'm holding my muscle more into the competitions. I thought at Toronto you look spectacular. I thought your conditioning is good. It's always good. Are we going to see a better Wilmore? Are we going to see a harder conditioned athlete than you was even in Toronto? Absolutely. There you go. Absolutely. Chad Nichols Flex Online.